You know, sometimes you do stuff and, you know, you, you were thinking of having, like, oh, maybe I could use this for something. You know, you just keep it around. Um, uh, I, this is one of those sorts of things. It's, uh, you've, saw, you've seen the Radcon Royal Rumble. It was good. You know, we made a bunch of characters. Separately, I made uh, four characters. You may be already be thinking, oh, that's from My Little Pony, it's Diamond Tiara. That's true. I made a bunch of waifus that I like. I don't know why. Well, obviously I know why, because it's fucking hot, dude. She had to fight each other. And I recorded a couple fights with them, fighting each other to see who would win the battle of the waifus. And you're like, who, which waifu is the strongest? And therefore is the one most uh, deserving of me? That doesn't make any sense. But it, Yeah, that it's just hard to explain that... Like, I don't know what I was gonna do with this. I think I was gonna, like, pretend commentate over it, which is what I'm doing. I'm gonna commentate over it, but it... I, I was thinking of it being, like, a big, like, deal. Ugh, excuse me. Like, a big deal with, like, stuff. You know, with, like... Oh, I uh, use voice clips and stuff, but then Vriska and Undyne don't have voice clips, so it's like that. That didn't, wouldn't work. You like them, by the way? They're the I, I like Diamond Tiara. She doesn't look very good here. She looks fucking crazy here, but like normal. Like she's the most normal of them, I think. Anyway, it's, it's fucking waifu battle, and, and this guy, he's pretty. He's pretty. <coughs> oh, excuse me. I'm just waiting for the load. It will just cut. Cut the loading. Ugh, cut the loading right out. All right, and here we are. Finally, we're we're doing the we're doing the thing. We've got Diamond Chara here. Look at her. She's got a she's got a whole thing going. She's all like, yeah, I'm I'm a pretty girl. Just one thing I should notice. I, I should have I, I realized. All of these waifus are not human. This is a pony, humanized as a person, because you can't make pony characters, obviously. They need hands and fingers and such. Um, and then there's Marceline, which is a vampire, kind of. She's, she's not a human, she's a vampire. Then there's Undyne, which is a fish monster. Literally a monster is like her race. She's got the doll bill back there. And uh, then there's Vriska, who is an alien. So I, I, apparently I don't like... I don't like real girls. I like fucking weird bitches. Bitches from around the realms. And they're coming. And there... There she is. Oh, oh my. I forgot that... Uh, you know that they have a boob slider in this game? Turn that up to maximum. Of course I did. Blur, blur, huge tits. There it is. There she is. She's the hot one. But will she win? I don't know. Because I can't remember. There was like a bunch of matches. So it's it's like I'm actually commentating. I I don't know who's gonna win. Well, look at her go. Look at that. Um, whatever it is. Oh yeah, there it is. The she's hanging upside down like a spider bat. As his her um, you know, theme. She's a spider kind of girl. And uh, there she is. She's looking all attractive and stuff. But is she? made of the right stuff that will, uh, fucking, I don't know, kill... See, this is the reason why I wasn't sure about commentating on this. Because I'm not a commentator at heart. I'm just, uh, there, I'm just, I'm just dumb. There's Marceline. Tall and thin. Got her new outfit, as Mar Marceline does. She has a new outfit every time. She's got like a goth thing going on with the webbing and the and the, the leather. Pretty good, pretty great. Very tall. You know. I, she she likes red things. And uh, that's Marceline. I just, I don't know. You know. How do you commentate on something as stupid as this? Hey. <sighs> Maybe I, you know what I'm gonna I'm gonna pass you over to Hippo. Hippo's gonna do Hippo's gonna do this next one. Well, 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 hello. I I I just 
Oh, oh, shut up! Get out of here, hippo! You suck! It's not even your voice. It's not even your real voice. You're just you're just making a silly voice. Not not trying to. You're just getting all flustered because you you're an idiot. Not me though. I guess I'll have to do. This is Undyne, also known as Under the Sea. Undyne the Sea. She uh, is a is a strong boy girl. Got an eye patch on the right eye, uh, which is the left eye. She's doing her macho uh, gallivant gallop. She's a she's very tall, and yeah, that, that's all. Uh, yeah. Think about Undyne. She doesn't have a nose, so I had to try and flatten her face, but I couldn't really flatten it, you know, all the way. So it's just sort of like it's a normal nose kind of. And they're off. Going with a with a grab and the I don't know any wrestling terms. You I don't know fucking anything about wrestling. Uh, the Gordon Marceline versus Diamond Charge, whacking her with a fucking a fucking foot in the thing, and and Undyne's got up in the head and smacked Riska down onto the thing, and oh my god, wow, this stuff happening all the time. In this in this ring, Diamond Char DT, as she is known, her phrase uh, that we came up with at Radcon is money on her mind and glitter on her vagina. That is her mantra. That is her magnum uh, dong, as it were. That is what she says every time she wins. Will she win? Will we hear it? Well, I, uh, you won't, because I didn't. I didn't. I don't have a sound clip of that. Can you imagine if you get that from, like, My Little Pony? Make her say that, like, get all the words Diamond Tiara said, and money on her mind and, money on my mind and glitter on my vagina, you know, you get all those words, syllables in, in, in order. What a, oh shit. We got a, we got a tag team duo fucking, uh, glitching through the side of the, whatever. Diamond, fucking, this, this, this stuff's happening, you know? There's risk of being pushed on her, on her, uh, large chest, it should give like proper like. Oh no, she's going for the throat. She's vicious. Diamond Tiara is the smallest, as she is a little girl. But uh, as for the purposes of fuck, whoa, is that out? Is that out? Is that Royal Rumble? Yeah, she's out. Risk is gone. I didn't. I don't remember it going out that quick. So now it's uh, it's this Undyne and. and and Marceline, the big ones, the big strong ones, having a having a go at it. But then, you know, Diamond Charles, she's, she's small, but she's feisty. She's got that that raw, um, that crazy attack dog sort of uh, style, where she's just unrelenting, doing an arm twisty, kicking her in the face with a punch to the under the arm, and then oh, it's a reversal with an upside down flip haps. Yeah, I haven't seen that ever. It's a brand new move. Oh, and a punch over the head because she's too small. You missed. You've been thrown around, kicked in the groin. But for women, doesn't matter. I realize they both got jeans on. That's kind of boring. They could have had something else, but they kind of just do wear jeans. So I don't know. Oh, you twisty arm Chinese uh, Chinese burn, as 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 it's known in the on the playground, as I as I recall, where you get you grab the arm. I think in America it's called an, a Native American burn or an Indian burn. But then yeah, there it is again, like crunch. Really hurts. She, Tommy Jarrett, just watching this happen. She's she's a she's a clever cat. She knows to to hang back and let the big brutes fight it out. It's like that that famous saying. If you're a little person, wait until your big guys are dead. If there's two Goliaths, just let them have it with each other, and then come in and kill them when they're down. <laughs> it's a bit of a... oh, you're breaking it up? No! You're just getting antagonized by the big fish woman. What are you doing? Oh, you got reversed, and... Whoa! That was a shocking kick to the fucking hell! She's pushing... You push it up. Oh, this is uh, this is uh, this is what you call a three-way match, obviously, because you know there's three of them. A punch to the face, knocked down on the ground. There is no pinning in this match, by the way. It's Royal Rumble. I, sh I guess I should say there's the same match type. You know, Riska's got out because she got fallen out. What is this? Oh, this is the sideways crunch. Oh, but it's reversed, and Undyne is on the floor, 
her head's a little hurt, and then she gets punched in the face? Wow, Undyne's not very good. Getting beat the fuck out of. Maybe it's that depth perception. Maybe she really, you know, sucks to not have that eye. It really helps. You're missing, Dime Chiara. There you go, you got it. Oh, oh! Oh, Marceline! Oh, kicked her off. Undyne's is gone. Loser. And now, the battle of the big versus the small, the vampire versus the, um... Well, you know. Marceline's like a vampire, but she's not a bad person. Daimi Tiara should be a vampire, because she's so evil. Except she's kind of a good person now, uh, I think. You know, she had that whole Reformation episode. That was a good episode. That was probably my favorite episode. I know it's somebody's favorite episode. It was a pretty good episode, you know? Crew Mark something or other. Oh, what a punch! to the face, you know, like uh, like I keep saying, they're, they're punching and kicking. This is what happens in wrestling. Whoa! They jumped up and fell down. That's the jump up and fall down attack. Never before seen. <laughs> Just like the other move, I didn't know what it was. Oh, she's she's back in the game. She's she's going. It's kind of an even match. They haven't really, like, like shown dominance one over the other necessarily. That was a, that was a bit of a slap in the face. Ooh! Crikey! Bloy me! Who's gonna win? Ouch! They must be f fucking saying. They must be saying ouch. And it's another upside down attack. Oh, and a, an elbow to the back of the neck. That's what you don't want. Whoa! That's that's a that's what you call a basketball hoop slam dunk. Uh, without the hoop. And, and without decapitating the person, thereby putting the head through the hoop. It's just bringing the body down to the ground. This looks bad. This looks bad for Dime Chiara. Oh, no, she's she's punching back. She's looking around. There's nothing there. You've seen how close you are to the end. Oh, oh dear. I think Marceline might have it. You know, she hasn't been really on the ropes at all yet. There's that one moment near the beginning. Oh, no, this is it. This is probably it. She's getting pushed further. Oh, come on, struggling. So the crowd does not give a shit about anything that's going on. Look at them, they're just completely like, yeah, yeah. Just girls, whatever. Whatever, just girls. Oh, and she's gone. I didn't even commentate on that. Diamond Child's dead. And the winner of match one... Oh, looking at replays. Yes, we, we saw this. Yeah, we could... We should, by the way, I, I saw it. I, I talked about it. You don't need to go back. Who's the camera guy? I just... I, all right, yeah, but the the winner of all right, we're still doing replay. Oh, well, this is the bit I didn't say anything about. She's got her on the ropes, and then she kicks her, and then she falls off because that's what happens. Yeah, well. And the winner of the thing, Marceline, the vampire queen, the vampire queen. Oh my God, she's rolling on the floor. She's really hurt. And people saying you mad with signs that are the same. Why would you mess? Mass produce signs. Yeah, Marceline's all quite chipper about this, and it's like happy, joyous. Daimachara's like wallowing in misery, like, oh, oh, it's just like that time I fell in the mud and the pig got my diamond tiara. And that's, and then freeze frame, and uh, th there we go. That was a good match, but they're not done. These, these girls, they really want to be uh, with me so much that they try it again. There's, so now Marceline is is the champion. <coughs> Who's gonna fucking beat Marceline, or is Marceline gonna win again? A uh, second time in the row. I think it's like best of three. So I'm pretty sure Marceline doesn't win. But who will win in this one? I don't know. I can't remember. So now we're getting uh, much as the same as before. Riska didn't really get much action last time, so hope hopefully she gets to do something this time. Just like she's pushing Undyne. Undyne is um. Whoa, Undyne's really going immediately. Is she gonna die? She's going phasing through that boob there. Oh my god, she's gone. Undyne is fucking terrible. She didn't do shit. Come on, what the hell, dude? I thought you were the strongest. M you could suplex a bowl. You know? Super bowl. Oh, shit. You know, if if we're thinking about, like, the, the types of characters, they're all kind of bitches, but Friska and Diamond Chiara are definitely the bitchier. You know, they're, they're more vicious and evil than Marceline and Undyne. So, so who's gonna win? Is it gonna be the good guys or the bad guys? I mean, I think I said Marceline won't win. 
But then again, I, I, I don't know. Wow, oh wow, come on, what the fuck, that was, she's just a boy, she's just a boy, you're kicking her like, she ain't nothing, oh god, is she gonna die, is this it, I didn't think this would be it, you just kick back, no, no, oh my god, you did so well last time, it's so, so quick, what the fuck happened, right Riska, this is the grey girl fight now, Homestuck vs Adventure Time, which is better? Honestly, it's uh, probably Homestuck. Come on, come on now. Come on, Adventure Time's pretty good, but come on now, I'm doing pretty good too. And she, she's immediately... Diamond Chara walking back there. And she, and fucking Marceline is on the ropes. She's really struggling. Is, is this gonna happen so quick? that this, this can't happen that quick. It happened that quick, okay. That wasn't really a match. Nothing... We're getting replay. There's nothing to replay. You ju we just saw this. This is that's not a replay. There's nothing in this match. Just everyone just instantly died. They didn't fight back at all. Well, Riska, you did it. You're now the number one waifu. At least you got one point in this race. You know, it's pretty good. I do I do like the fact that you have the largest boobs. That is very nice. But also you have the largest butt. I think, yeah, you probably do. But mainly, you won the match. That's more important than being uh, big boobs. You you won the match. Uh, th therefore, by law, you are my waifu supremo. Unless, you know, we do another match because that one was really fucking short. And come on now, come on now. You know. Also, Diamond Chiaro, she wants to win. Undyne wants to win. You know, who's gonna be? I think there's just one match left, so one of them is gonna be a loser forever. And she will forever be not a winner. Because, we, you know, these characters exist only on the the PS3 in Digi's house, and I don't think they're gonna use that game again for anything. And so if I wanted to do this again, I would have to make the characters again on my own game that I don't have. So this is it. This is the like the true end of to all end of waifu battles, uh, just, you know, until I decide to make another one. And we're going straight at it with falling around and flipping and jumping and kicking and throwing and now it's uh, Diamond Chara vs Undyne and Riska vs Marceline. You know, Undyne is a uh, is you know she's not she's not a big pushover. She's not gonna lose immediately again, is she? Yeah, she did a thing. She did a head slap roundy bounce. And uh, pushing and shut. Oh, that's a bitch slap if I ever saw one from Diamond Tiara on Vriska there. Whoa, she's wobbling from, from her head hurting from that slap. That was a big slap. And then we were pushing uh, Undying all the ropes. The others are just sort of like, yeah, we'll grab your arm, do a twisty, and then a throwy. And get a headlock and a double upside down. Oh my god! That was a body throw to the ground. I didn't know it was possible. Oh, right in the face, right in the power, right in the kisser. You know what I'm saying? Well, Diamond Chara's got Marceline right there. Oh, but she's saved by Undyne's punch. Oh my god! Everyone hates a Diamond Chara. Why? Is it because she's not like she's like the most human-skinned of them all? Are they that racist? They probably are, actually. Fucking Undyne hates humans. Marceline is, uh, I don't know. I don't know what Marceline thinks about humans. There's only one in the show. Maybe two. And uh, Vriska, I mean, she knows a bunch of humans, so I guess... Because she's like... She's not racist. I think the most racist would probably be Dime Chiara, because she, uh, she doesn't like, you know, people, you know, unicorns and such. Well, maybe she does. You know, I really know nothing. I know nothing about anything, and here is a body slam, I think. Was that actually like a body slam? No, that wasn't. That was like a flip round super doop. We got a... Oh, we got a crunch to the face, to the teeth. She's ripping her face off. Oh, good God. That's a dangerous thing to be doing in the, in the world of wrestling. You might get in trouble with the police if you rip a fucking person's face off. And that's a kick. A right double hop kick to the head. And another... She's really resilient. She oh my god, that <laughs> took me off guard. That was a, that was quite like an actual like momentum swing. She nearly fell off. And that that couldn't have been uh, you know. Whoa, uh, you missed Undyne. God, how is she taking all this 
brutal punishment. These people are throwing Diamond Chara around. Still, she's like, eh, just fucking... But she's, you know, she's a survivor. She's a tough little cookie. Whoa, she fucking, did you see that? Undyne phased through her. We'll replay that. That's, that was like Dragon Ball Z. That was Naruto. That was teleport behind you, like, lel, or something. Oh, dear. What has become... I'm, I'm not really pay, paying attention to the Marceline of Risca fight. Because it's hard to, to see them. They're just sort of like the same guy. They got blue pants and, and, and fucking grey skin. And they're showing their bell... Oh! Ah, that's it. Marceline is a loser. But, uh... You know, she won at least once. That's alright. So now it's Risca could potentially win twice in a row. Will she do it? The other two are sort of doing a ballerina thing over here. They're just coming in to fight them up. To be quite honest with you, Marceline ain't that big of a, like, a waifu. These three are like my... I don't know, actually. Oh, they're doing a, they're doing a d double, double hurdle faddle with a crumbling punch in the kick in her face and stuff. But like, when it comes to waifus, like, there's always like ones you like more than others. And I haven't watched Adventure Time in a very long time, so I don't even know. Like, I, I, I stopped a long time ago. I, you know there was that, like, that Japanese-directed one? You know? Like, it was really weird. I never even got to that one. So there's a lot of Adventure Time to see. But, you know, Homestuck I read the whole of. Undertale is just one game. My Little Pony I've stopped watching, but... I think I've watched more, more like My Little Pony than Adventure Time. Be quite honest, I think they have something that's real. Jeez. But yeah, these are like more. I would like one of these three to win, if anyone. Yeah, forget the other rounds. This is the real round. Whoever wins this round is the real one, because it's one of these three. And that's good. I don't need two grey girls in my life, it's too many. Eee. Wow! I I don't I don't care. I'm not I'm not one for reacting like that to things that aren't real. They're not real. They're just pretend. Oh, she's calling a timeout. You can't time out. You can't time out and then jump and miss. That was ex embarrassing on many levels. You missed again. I'm dying. You suck. Oh, you got her. Oh, you got her again. Jesus, these legs are so big. You're really fucking her up, and you're really being fucked up. This is you know this is one of those battles that. You really, you realize that like when you watch actual wrestling, that I have a couple of times due to broken mat. I realize that the commentators don't say anything; they're just sort of like, "And this is really the the thing that's gonna change the 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 th the, the career of this guy." Yep. Oh, that was a that was a power bomb, and it, like they don't say fucking anything. So the fact that I'm even saying this much. Probably like the best commentating I've ever heard. Even if it's about nothing in particular. Oh, she fell over. What was that? Was this is not football? You can't pretend to foul. Oh, she's hurt. She's holding her hip. She's not really. Go she's she's straggling. But she's still going in. She's not hold hiding in the back. She's a real fighter. Oh God, no, no! Don't frisk her up against the thing. It's supposed to be. That's a character from the Undertale. Sands. You made a pardon about Frisk. Well, that's one where I'm not Sans. I'm a, I'm hypocrite. I'm also great. Maybe that's why I like Riska and, and Marceline. Because I am hypocrite. And I'm gray. Well, I thought I was gray. No, hippo. I am gray also. Whoa. Touching her. Pushing her. Oh, is this it? That's that. usually the animation in Undyne is out. Oh, she's mad about it. Undyne. You didn't want a single match. You're a dad to me. Whoa, what is this? Lewdness. That's quite a position. Alright. It, it, it ended. Kinda wanted it to keep going, if you know what I'm saying. Whoa, that was a move. That was like a fucking Tekken combo. Ow. Punch me. I punch you. Oh, uh, punch me. I kick you double. Oh, that's good. That's a good... That's a good fucking attack. Oh my god, is it? Oh, no, no, not quite, not quite. Risk is holding on, but this is it. This is it. She's got the, the fucking bot bump. 
Oh! With a butt bump! The sexiest thing in the world! She wins... Oh, oh, we're looking at replays. I'm trying to say... Like, I, I, it kind of ruins the hype. Like, I don't care about this. This isn't what just happened. So um, I don't really want to talk about it, because it happened a while ago. Fuck with the replays. This isn't even the end. Why would you not replay the butt bump? The butt bump was the coolest thing ever. You gonna show it? Oh, there it is. Here it is. Oh, she won. Oh, it's Diamond Chiara. She, with the butt... That was just great. What a way to win. With a, with a, with a move she hadn't used the entire game. It's Diamond Chiara. Money on a mind and glitter on a vagina. Money on a mind and glitter on a vagina. Money on a mind and glitter on a vagina. Money on a mind and glitter on a vagina. That's the the song that's playing in the background. Cause that's her theme song. Cause she won. She's the winner. She's got all the money. She's got all the, the honey. I guess that's me. I'm the honey in this situation, which is kind of gay. To say out loud, but it's true. Briska's dead. She died. She's not alive anymore. Just like in real life. And that is... Like, four hours or five or six hours. I don't know how many hours I wasted at Radcon 2. Uh, and I made a video about it. And this is what it was. So, thanks for watching.